What is going on guys? Welcome back to the channel and I appreciate you being here. Today I bring you another Destiny 2 video and today I want to instruct you on things you should be doing and why, i.e. Ada One's augmented weapons. But before we go any further guys, if you do enjoy the video and would like to show your support, you can by hitting that like button. And if you are new around here and enjoy daily Destiny 2 videos, be sure to subscribe. Okay, so Ada One, the Black Armory vendor. Not only does she offer daily and weekly bounties, Black Armory weapon schematics and mod components, she also offers things called research weapon frames. Now I ain't gonna lie, the first few of these I picked up, I completed them and wasn't impressed at all with the rewards. As far as I could see, they were just standard weapons. But I was wrong guys, there are actually legit hidden gems within these bounties which to be honest are 100% worth the grind for. Not that the grind is even crazy. The weapon frames normally consist of Crucible Arsenal, Dreaming City Arsenal, Gambit Arsenal, Destination Arsenal and Vanguard Arsenal. Each costs for modulus reports. Modulus reports are rewarded for forge completions as well as daily bounties. Now an image was shared with me of a weapon from an augmented bounty which is already one of the best PvP weapons in the game which I'll show you in a second, this actual image changed my mind on these useless augmented weapon frames. They actually could indeed be worth doing, like I said, there are hidden gems in these. The Crucible Arsenal will obviously reward you Crucible augmented weapons. The Dreaming City Arsenal bounty equals a Dreaming City weapon. The Gambit Arsenal will reward you a Gambit weapon and so forth. So what actually are augmented weapons and why are they named this? Well at first I read via a bungee post they would offer a selection of perks you could pick between but the first few I completed didn't seem to have this selection unless I'm an idiot and didn't notice them which is probably the case but this image was shared with me which you guys can see on screen now it shows a bygones which we all know is a beast of a weapon one of the best pvp weapons in the game and it is very very popular indeed that is for sure but notice the two perks this thing has which you can choose between yes that is rampage and kill clip these are paired with outlaw arguably the perfect of perfect roles built for pvp and they're all rolled into one weapon although this would be considered one of the rarest and um, best weapons possibly you can get from these augmented bounties imagine what else would be possible when you consider the entire loot pool of the game is basically in these augmented bounties besides the raid which i'm pretty sure will be incorporated sooner or later now i have been doing as many as i can of these since i've seen these bygones and although i am yet to get an amazing weapon they are another part of this grind to chase that is for sure each augmented weapon frame bounty costs 4 modulus reports. I believe you can only do 5 per week per character of these augmented weapons. So if you were to do these on every character, it would be 60 modulus reports needed. Which to be honest, is a grind in itself to obtain. But hey, if you have been busy farming the forges like I have, you should have more than enough. Remember also the daily bounties also reward you 1 modulus report for completing that bounty. I believe the forges reward you two per completion it could be more could be less i'm not entirely sure on that but i do believe it's two but yeah guys just a quick video on these augmented weapons and what they offer and what they are and why you should be doing these let me know guys if you guys have been rewarded any little hidden gems let me know what the weapon is and the role it had on it but on that note guys we have come to the end of the video if you guys enjoyed it leaving a like really helps out if you're new around here and enjoy daily destiny 2 videos be sure to subscribe and if you never want to miss a video i upload hit that bell button to turn notifications on but guys thanks as always for stopping by and hopefully i will see you on that next one